Yeah, as that puck ends up coming to the top of the slot, Ryan Valentini was trying to make a play at the line, but the puck ends up coming back into the hands of the Coventry Blaze, and they're going to try and work up ice. Tyler Kirkup sees the hit coming in from Carter Johnson, and that's to Jettison, but Coventry hold the puck in, and now here is Talberg with the first chance of the night. Stopped by Carr! Oh, there's a rebound that somehow stays out the back of the net. Cleared out of the crease by a Dundee defenseman. That'll be icing in the blaze. Just over a minute into this hockey game, got a real good chance to. Yeah, ni nice quick play from the bra blaze on the transition. We see him come up the left wing. Kim Tauber gets in, and he's looking for Kirkup. Takes the shot. Kirkup there on the follow-up. Uh, doesn't quite get it over the line, but a good opportunity for the commentary blaze early doors. Yeah. David Clements will go and mop up back in his own zone. He's got Don Hauser. Cooker's options. Comes up coming to the near side boards, chipped back in by a Dundee star. That was Valentini. One of several uh, OHL alumni. Oh, Dundee, you've got this puck in behind the blaze on a two on one. Now nice chips it to Valentini, scores! Early goal for the Stars. They win a puck along the wall, along the uh, blaze blue line. And a familiar sight, the Dundee Stars get an odd man rush and they get a, an early goal in this one as the Blaze just couldn't handle this puck and a lovely finish and a lovely source of pass for the Dundee Stars to open the scoring. Yeah, quick turnover from the Dundee Stars right on the blue line there, quickly gets that puck, they turn around and go the other way, Spencer Nals just feathers it nicely over to Valentini who then puts it past Taron Cozen. Simple goal for the Dundee Stars and they're one ahead. Yeah. Roth tries to win that one along the boards for the Blaze. Britain using his size, he'll dump that in. Norwich first to the puck, plays it off Parentino, it's out in front. Dryden Dow's going to wrist one, he scores! It looked like the stick of Cozen got taken away on the play. But the Dundee Stars have scored twice in quick succession. Dryden Dow is fourth of the regular season already. Captain leading by example, Stu. Yeah, Dundee Stars again turn that puck over in the, in the offensive zone there. And Dow just comes across, takes a shot from the blue line, or just in front of the blue line. The Dundee Stars are going to chip that puck in behind Brady Norris. Norris's pass comes off the stick of Josh Britton, and now the Dundee Stars might have another opportunity. A puck on its side ends up going over the top of the net. Spencer Allen throws one towards the goal. Goodness gracious, it bounces off the top of the net of Taron Cozen. Now here comes J.D. Dudek. Dudek's going to get around McKay with some nice hands. Just to drop it off for Talberg. Good hit from Talberg to win that puck for Coventry. Shearer drops it up. Excuse me, Thompson drops it off. Shot comes in, blocked on the way through into the netting. And we'll have a stoppage. It was a really nice bit of physical play by Kim Talberg there in the corner. Uh, Dudek starts that opportunity by dumping it in. Nice little bit of hands, follows it in. And then Talberg with the physicality. And it's his body position that allows him to win that puck more than anything. And I'm not trying to take away from Kim Talberg's game because we know that he plays physical. But it was almost role reversal. You know, JD Dudek, often known for the physicality, getting in front of net and being that type of player. And Talberg more with the stick handling. And the Blaze have scored off the face of it's Luciani. Alessio Luciani with a big redirection. That'll be uh, his first pro goal, Stu, with a couple of assists in the league and in the cup. And he'll head to the bench. And well, that was a big response from Coventry. A feathered shot in. He's got a lovely bit of hand eye coordination in front of Carr. And the Blaze are on the board. If you're going to score your first pro goal, make it a good one. And that's a nice goal for Alessio Luciani. Getting in front of net, getting a good bit of hand eye coordination. Shows a lovely bit of skill uh, from the young forward to get himself on the score sheet and bring it back to 2-1 to the Dundee Stars. Norris trying to slip it up the boards to Hopkins, a little backhand fling out in front for J.D. Dudek in open ice. I think he was worried about the offside there, Dudek, but either way, the commentary plays hard and on the four checker. Going to win this puck through Hopkins. Hopkins to the point. Norris is open. He's going to put one on net. Oh, oh lovely. Oh, with a big rebound out off the backboards. Carr makes a couple of stops. Hopkins tried to shovel it across to Shear. It just didn't connect. That might give the Stars a chance. Up ice again on an odd man rush. Shot comes in. Blocked on the way through. Brady Norris down on his knees. Takes that chance away. I love the idea from Hopkins. He tried to settle the puck to shoot. It never really laid down for him. So he thinks, OK, I'm going to shovel this across to Shearer. Lovely idea. It was just you know, almost about six inches too far ahead of Shearer. Puck ended up back the other way, but great job by the captain to get down with a sacrifice play to take that shot away. 
Britain gives a check to Carter Allen in the corner. Luciani back out on the ice after his first pro goal. He's looking to dig it out. Oh, it's gone for the Stars! And a big opportunity goes wide of the net. It's dumped back out in front. Cozen's down trying to take away the low part of the ice. Maybe uh, grab that puck in. Sean Allen now. He shoots off the stick of Luciani into the netting. And, wow, the Dundee Stars flexing right back and coming up ice against the Blaze on the offense. I suspect this is what's going to be the story of the game this evening. These two teams kind of trading blows toe-to-toe -to -toe like heavyweight fighters up and down the ice. Luciani. Nice play from Cook to set the screen. Thompson. Thinks about the shot, gets to the top. He is going to shoot now off the body in front. Puck is still there. It's batted out of the air. Coventry still in possession as the Stars come back to full strength. Thompson fires. Snapped out of the air by Carr and he hangs on for the whistle. Nice little play from Blake Thompson to round that, off, that power play off. We'll just see it again here on the replay. He looks to see, he takes takes the first rebound and cut, kicks it off. And then look again here as he gets the pass. He looks over, realises that there's a Dundee player cutting across that passing lane. He throws it in on net instead. Stretch pass down that right wing side, James. Uh, Shearer tries to get a stick on it either way. Players are going to pick it up back in their own zone. Norwich couldn't get clean connection on the uh, clearance attempt. Blaze don't mind that too much if they can get it out here. But back with the Stars though, Britain. Oh, he gets checked hard into the corner by Brady Norris. It's going to be a penalty on the play. Britain was turning. And Chris Ingalls has dropped his gloves here. Brady Norris not wanting much of that. I think he's quite happy to... Uh, you know, draw some kind of minor maybe off Ingalls, but you know, Josh Britton back to his feet and he's okay, but he was turning and you know, certainly caught a face full of the boards there, Stu. Yeah, clear. One minute, one minute remaining in the first. Still Dundee 2, Coventry 1 after a quick couple of goals from the Stars. Now here's Luciani looking for his second of the night. Padded away by Carr. Well, that really would have been the floodgates opening. He gets his first pro goal, quickly followed by his second. Puck sent to the top of the slot by Rinaldi. Shot wide of the net of Cozen. Dundee looking to start quickly here on the, uh, the restart. Christo digging that puck up. He finds Kobe Roth. The Blazers are going to get a two-on-one. McNulty up ice with some speed. Roth out in front looking for McNulty. It came off the stick of Carl who put it straight in the passing lane. Nice veteran play by the goalie. That's kept alive by the Blaze defenseman. Shot comes wide of Kevin Carr's goal. Luciani drops it off for Kirkup. Kirkup, oh, lovely D to D pass from Kirkup. Shot comes in, padded away by the netminder car. Big hit comes in in the corner from Kirkup. Blaze have a chance here from Cook. Stick save from Carr. I love the rebound control, just shoving that one into the perimeter. Nice work from the goalie. Danger not averted though. Thompson. What a JD Dudek is going to look in. Thompson on the one timer. Comfortable save by Carr. They have got it in, but it'll be waved away. Tyler Kirk up throwing a little bit of glove punching down there with uh, the other Allen, Sean Allen. Well, the Coventry Blaze did have the puck in the net, but the whistle had gone prior. Yeah, the whistle had gone prior. That goal is not going to count. Um, that was uh, well and truly washed off before it was uh, potentially in the back of the net. 35 seconds of power play left. Christo might throw it to the back door as it's got McNaughty arriving, decides to hang on and let the Blaze milly around and Try and find a seam. Norrish shoots one. Looking for a redirection and they score! Roth again! Six and six! And that man just cannot stop scoring for the Coventry Blaze. He ties it up at two. And again, it's a little snapper from Brady Norrish through a crowd that you can see in front of Carr. The rebound comes right to Roth and he buries it. Another great piece of hand-eye coordination from the Blaze forward sitting on the post. As we see there, Brady Norrish comes across, floats one in, and then it's off there in the middle of the air. Kobe Roth bats it out and puts it in the back of the net. Christo, cross ice. Oh, nice feed from Christo. Chance out in front. Thompson. Thompson on the doorstep from Kukali. Not something you'd see very often there, Stu, but uh, plays really nice, looking for a little, little tic-tac-toe uh, tic play. But I, I like that, getting the defence activating where they can. Kukali getting in the rush, getting in front of the net as well. Yes. You know, it's, it, fun, good fundamental hockey there. 
Yeah, I, absolutely. I love it. I love it even more when this cover and you saw the you know the blaze forwards there, rolling back, looking to pick up that cover. You know the Dundee Stars have scored a two on one tonight already. And you know, bear in mind, yeah, okay, the Blaze gave that puck up on their own blue line, um, but you still need you need, need cover if guys like Norris, Thompson, as they score, Dundee from seemingly nothing. Look at that puck at the hash marks. It's dispatched to the net. And they make it 3-2. They get their lead back. It's Josh Britton, the former devil, sniping one past his former netminder in Taron Cozen. Yeah, it just manages to find a gap in the ice there, right in the middle of the circle on the dot there. Um, puck kind of springs back to him, as we see again here on the replay. Just snaps it there past Taron Cozen. Not much that the Blaze netminder can do on that one. And the Dundee Stars go back into the lead 3-2. Kukali along the boards. McNulty, three minutes to go in this period. Thompson, Talberg. Bobbling puck, he just feathers that one in. The Swede trying to find Alexander Kukali below the goal line as Talberg's D to D pass didn't quite work out. He is going to peel and go and get it, and he's on side. Talberg down the guts, he's got a chance, he scores! Talberg, wonderful! From helping out on the D to back in his natural habitat, scoring goals. And the Blaze have tied it up quickly at three. And I just love this shift from Kim Talberg, and it culminates in a goal. Uh, just taking the opportunity when it came. Good team play, standing on left defence, filling in for Alexander Kukali, who was up in the forward play. Then comes in, picks the puck up, and just dives straight down the middle, attacks the scene, takes a shot, goes past low on that, pad, on that blocker side. Fantastic piece of skating and skating from the Kim Talberg. Norrish dumps that one in, gets checked by Sean Allen. They're going to go at each other here in the uh, defensive zone. Allen's going to take Norrish's stick away. Meanwhile, Dundee are heading up ice. Shot stopped by Taron Cozen. Thompson quickly into the play defensively. Big one-timer blocked away by Cozen. Action at both ends of the ice. Is that one banked in front? It was... A scramble play. Coventry going to try and head up ice with Cook. Talberg now. Coventry had to be good defensively there. Oh, there's an awful collision in the backboards. And Kim Talberg going to end up in the box here. Really awkward. As we uh, stand on the 47th minute here, Stu. Another little mark of respect to, uh, to Adam Johnson. The country players are going to go short-handed here. Getting on to the halfway mark of this period. Still three apiece. Shot comes in from the perimeter. Oh, big rebound! Dryden Dow couldn't settle it, and then he hits the crossbar. Just took him a second to get his bearings, and... Well, he clanged the pipe, second time in this period for Dundee where they've hit the red stuff. Norris, D to D. Here comes Shearer. Lovely vision to pick out Kirk up. Can get into the offensive zone though. Phelan and Norris are going to go into the corner. Norris trying to fight away from Phelan and get involved in the play. That puck's going to come out loose and they score! A broken play, the puck comes out in front and Johnny Walker buries it for his first of the regular season and gives the Dundee st the Stars their lead back. The boards play, the puck out in front and just like that, Dundee have that lead once more in this hockey game, Stu. Yeah, just got it in short side there. Puck comes out. Bit of a battle on the boards there. You see there, Walker peels off and then the puck just appears on his stick. You know, short opportunity, but they managed to get themselves in the lead. Ingles shoots through a crowd, padded away by Cozen, the rebounds in front of him, he has to make a stretch save on that opportunity in tight. Well, that have, uh, that have sealed it, I think, for the Stars, but Cozen does well to keep it at bay. There's Norrish. Dumps it in. Check comes in on Dowd. Dowd as well, just to kind of angle off Norrish and Come to keep it in the zone though. Talberg on the backboard, shovels it out in front. It came free, but the Dundee Stars might have a play at the empty net here. They're going in with Nas, they seal it. It is Dundee five, Coventry three. And it started as a two goal advantage for Dundee early in the first period. And it looks like it's going to finish that way, Stu. 
Yeah, absolutely. Dundee Stars get that turnover there and win, make, free the puck up, then send it down. And Spencer Nars just uh, gets it in and taps it in for the empty netter to make it 5 3.